Funeral service for fallen Coweta County Deputy Eric Minix is going to be this morning. Minix was killed in the line of duty last week. Atlanta News First Bridget Spencer is live for us from Crossroads Church. That's in Sharpsburg and Bridget, a very difficult time for this community. That's right. Services actually started yesterday afternoon. Dozens of people showed up to pay their respects, lining the streets to pay respects actually ahead of the funeral, which starts uh, later on this morning. I want to take you to video of what that procession was looking like. Lots and lots of people as part of the Coweta County community lined the streets to pay their respects to Deputy Eric Minix yesterday. He died last week after being hit by an Alabama police officer while trying to arrest a suspect for a stolen car. Now that police officer, we're told, was put on administrative leave as the investigation continues. Now the deputy, he leaves behind a wife and three children. Meanwhile, the Coweta County community, of course, rallying right behind the sheriff's office during this really difficult time for them. I heard about it in the like early mornings when it happened and it just, um, it was heartbreaking. The officer has uh, children that are pretty much like around my children's age or they're a little bit younger, but we have the same dynamic and I just wanted to come out here and support. Now flags will be lowered at half staff at the Georgia State Capitol as well as down here in Coweta County. That funeral service is set to start at 11 a.m. We're live in Sharpsburg, Bridget Spencer, Atlanta News.